Uh, yeah, hey Toby. Um, last month we have launched our bundle version for Microsoft 365 for Jira. And um, yeah, we got a lot of questions uh, on the strategy, on the next steps, why we did this. And uh, so, uh, yeah, let's have a, a quick chat about it and share our point of view um, and show the strategy. And the first thing that was always a um, question from partners and customers, why do we focus on Microsoft 365 that deeply? Uh, there is a lot of solutions already in the marketplace. And why do we need this bundle version, Microsoft 365 for Jira? Yeah. Well, I mean, I think from, I think we, we started when we started off, like I think almost seven years or more than seven years ago now, I think it has, has always been the, the focus um, of what we did, like integrating something that many people use all day, every day, uh, it was only Microsoft Outlook back then, but um, this is still true for, for other other tools now, like Teams. Um, it has always been like making a tool um, that, that you use every day um, more connected uh, so that you basically can use the, the information from other tools inside that tool or, or even the other way around. Um, especially regarding to communication, for example. Yes. Yeah, I think they have a real nice um, complementary feature set, like um, with Office 365, you get a lot of collaboration uh, and you have really proven tools with, um, with Outlook on Teams, for example. And Jira, you get a lot of these management focus, planning, agile um, methodologies. So I think they're really complementary and uh, to have a really, they, the features of Jira are unmatched in Microsoft 365 and vice versa. And so it's yeah. kind of get the best uh, that the, the world has to offer in, in one digital workplace, right? Yeah, and make it basically very easy to, to access either one uh, from both sides. Is there any configuration um, necessary from a, from a technical point of view? You mean to enable our apps? Yes. Well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I wish it wouldn't be necessary, but uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, we, um, as we, as we integrate very deeply with, with both sides, um, there, there is some, some initial configuration necessary. I mean, we try to document this as good as possible, obviously. Um, and it's not super complicated, but there there are maybe more steps required than than solutions that uh, do not integrate with with other systems. Yeah, so we need to set up some application links stuff on on Jira, for example, and um, you, you need to, for example, install some apps inside of Teams or Outlook. Um, but yeah, and I mean, what, what was your main reason to? Uh, decide for the bundle. I mean, uh, we, we had these separate products for a really, very long time. They, they have evolved. They were accepted by, by customers. And what was your main reason to say, yes, Andy, let's, let's go, uh, let's bundle them all together into, into one app? Well, I think that there are different reasons, um, to be honest. Um, I think what what I really like about the bundle is that we we can get um, all of the features in the hands of our customers uh, much easier now. Um, I think each and every one of our apps basically has like this one feature which I really like. Um, everyone that's on on Microsoft 365 and um, basically uses these tools um, has a need for all of our apps uh, because I really believe that all of them add value for for almost every use case to be honest um so i i do think that having them in one app is the best way forward for our customers for example i i, I love the idea that it is a, a it is a future proof um solution like microsoft 365 is heavily developed they add new features basically on a daily basis and um you, you never know how important is Outlook maybe in five years or uh, what is the 
what is the role of planner to do it? They they have a um, a skill set now, but you never know what Microsoft is going to push yeah. uh, next week, basically. And um, this was really hard um, to to cover uh, if you have separate apps. And so we can say now we want to provide the market leading app for Microsoft 365 and we will continue to develop and we will listen to the market trends and we are not really focused on one of these names. We can just create yeah. the best tool possible and uh, we can also mix and match between different tools. Like if you have uh, meetings, they are especially now with remote meetings, they are so closely tied with Microsoft Teams. Um, you do not want to have uh, separate apps. Um, and another topic would be maybe files. They are basically Teams now. It's SharePoint, yes, but they are also Teams. And uh, that's what I love, that we can now build really connected features and not have to think <coughs> in the silos ourselves and um, yeah. can just think about what is the best way to work and not what yeah. can we do with the following product name basically yeah i think like from 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 a product management perspective um internally it's it makes it makes much easier for example to say okay someone has an a good idea uh, but that previously that wouldn't have fit in any of the single products um, but now we can really judge the feature based on its usefulness and say, okay, well, um, that obviously goes into the bundle because um, that's like crosses between all of the the Microsoft um, yeah apps. Um, yeah, I think like yeah. that that makes the, it also easier thing. to yeah. to I think bring the, in smaller features. Yeah, and I think that the bundle is really going to be bigger than like the sum of these single apps. I hope so, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah what, I, what I also, I mean, it's it's super simple now. I mean, partners can, or partners or customers, they can just start with one use case and then they can involve without having to think about costs. They, they can also focus on their needs and uh, they do not have to keep any order or something. They can just improve workflow by workflow and say, okay, now we look at Teams and now we look at emails and then we look at calendar. And so they can just ramp it up without having to think of, oh, this is a new project. This is a new, uh, I need a quote, I need budget. No, they can just involve over time based on their needs. And this is what I really love that it is a really customer focused solution. Uh, obviously, we have some benefits there as well, which make it easier for us to to develop, to maintain. We uh, can focus our uh, efforts into one app. Um, but again, this is a win-win situation for for past customers and partners. Yeah, I think so. And what we also had in mind when we did it, like it's much more configurable now. So you can, um, for example, say you want to start using the Teams feature first, and then uh, maybe activate the email feature afterwards um, or only for specific projects. So we, we got a lot more flexible in that regard. Um, so yeah, that you can basically decide any time you want to use something more or something less. So uh, yeah. Do you want to share some of our roadmaps? Like, I mean, we, we mentioned that it's we, we focus yeah. our efforts now into this one app. So what can we expect there? Yeah, I mean, um, obviously there, there will be some features that that also will come to to I guess the single app still, but um, I guess like a big a big part will be um, these features, basically what you already said that that touch um, also the 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 cross section of of the different apps. For example, meetings and teams comes to mind. Like um, they they have been very close together anyway like if you if you schedule a meeting from a jira issue um having the teams dial in data in there um but if you if you think one step further it would totally make sense to also then be able to view the issue in your in your teams meeting side by side um act on the issue um add a status comment for example so that will be a big topic that we will identify like these things we, we couldn't really do in a sensible way before. Um, and the, the other thing which you already mentioned um, is um, the files. Um, 
which we are having he heavily thinking about like how do we that's also something we we haven't had before like how do you think about like you, you i mean you have attachment in jira issues and you have the files in teams uh, which which are provided by sharepoint and and onedrive um Both attachments and emails sure yeah and how how do we get this uh, together um in a way that, that that makes sense for for our customers, yeah. Yeah, I mean um, this is like the the short term roadmap, but with the bundle we we can also um, have a look on the yeah smaller features of Microsoft 365. Uh, Planner comes to my mind, uh, which was hard, uh, requested at least a couple of times already. Uh, bookings right. to to see availabilities uh, to to make customer's appointment or uh, enable partners also in yeah. the, um, maybe calendars, for example, to see uh, vacation times in the in a project or so. So there, yeah. I mean, we, we haven't uh, really confirmed anything of that. Yeah. But there is like, this is the flexibility we get for, yeah. for the future. Um, I think we will also, is, yeah, I think we'll also Based a lot of things on on customer and uh, partner feedback. To be honest, like what what goes first, um, I think like automation is also a big ask. We had a couple of times from customers already be, to be able to to send an email or to be able to send a meeting request or or a Teams uh, notification out um, based on 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 uh, workflows um, on or or on Jira automation. That that is also something we are considering. So. Yeah, there's yeah. a lot on the roadmap. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, and probably for for some customers or partners, uh, we will still keep these single apps. So this is one important thing. Yeah. We have like, um, from a technical point of view, we just really just merge the single apps. So we will, con on, on certain aspects, we will continue to develop the single apps. So you have not lost um, on these, these single apps, but of course the, the bundled uh, version is our future and uh, will become our main product there. Yeah. And yeah, if you if you don't know it, give it a try. Let us know. I mean, we, we are really flexible on the roadmap. Uh, we love to hear your thoughts on how you want to work with Office 365 and Microsoft. And yeah, give us, if you have ideas, if you have some needs, if you have a use case, just let us know. Give us a ping. <laughs>